Hello friends, thank you for joining me. It's Jenny. We are going to be setting up my journal for 2020. I am really excited. I'm a little behind the ball. A bunch of people have already set up theirs, but it's not quite the 15th of December yet. So I feel like it's time to jump on the bandwagon. All right. So this is my main title page. I'm still using my same journal that I've been using. I'm not going to start a new journal uh, for 2020. I already have another journal set up and ready to follow suit. Um, but this one um, is going to be fun and new and totally different than anything I've done this far or thus far. Pardon my misspeaking. I hope you can't hear that. My neighbor's daughter is having a temper tantrum. <laughs> And she's three, so, you know, it just goes with the territory. I feel bad for Mama. Okay, let's get started. So this is my entry title page. It just says 2020. It's so exciting. Starting a new year. Do you guys have resolutions that you're setting or goals that you're making for yourselves? I don't typically set resolutions because I never follow through. Um, I do have goals that I like to try to set for myself. Um, but if I don't meet them, it's not the end of the world. Like, I feel like resolution is more permanent than just setting a goal for yourself. Um, let's... Do, let me get my pens real quick and we can do the fireworks on my page. Let's do purple. Um, or not. My pen doesn't want to work. Oh no. Let's try a different purple. I think I need to start weeding through my pens. I have 140 gel pens here and I have more back in my craft room. Here, this one's working. There we go. I need to start getting rid of the pens that don't work anymore. <clears throat> Instead of trying to save them by tapping them. <laughs> Okay, let's do purple down at the bottom. And we'll do my purple sparkles for this one. And there's my neighbor's dog. Yay! I might be doing a voiceover. <laughs> we'll see. Let's try blue. Well, this doesn't look blue at all. This looks weird. It looks green and purple. This is an interesting looking pen. Let's see what happens. It is blue right now. Sparkles. And let's do yellow for the other fireworks. There's yellow. Well, that doesn't show up very well. Oh well, that's okay. I can see it. I'm sorry you guys probably can't see it. 
I apologize. Let me get my eraser real quick. Okay. There we go. There's our opening page for 2020. Thank you for hanging with me. Here's January's opening page. Let's see if you can see that. We'll zoom in a little bit. I love learning new things about my camera. See, I don't want to do my J like that. Um, I'm going to do it different. Let me erase it because that's going to mess me up. There we go. So this is supposed to be like a snow globe village with a sleigh. So I'll have to do a lot of coloring, but I won't do that on camera. I'll show you guys when we do the flip through um, for next week. Here's the sleigh. And the tree. Three-year-olds are so much fun. Speaking of three-year-olds, my grandson will be here in about a week and a half, and I can't wait. Okay, Dutch door. That's what it's called. We're doing Dutch doors. Let's zoom back out. Sorry, guys. We're doing Dutch doors for the year, for the whole year. I'm really nervous and excited. There's a lot um, on for each week. There's a lot going on. I don't I hope you can see in pencil. I have the month up here. I have my mood tracker and my um, habit tracker up at the very top. And this is the part that will stay. I have my focus area for the month that um, I will put things that I want to focus on for myself, for bettering my own personal self. My weekly schedule because I am now starting a job um, in two days three days on Monday today's Friday so I'm really excited it's actually Friday the 13th which is like a lucky day for me so um I don't know it's a good day anyway here's my schedule here's my um line of day or see I, I wrote grateful for but this is my oh no I have line of day on the other page so this is what I'm grateful for this is for the weekend um Saturday because I do uh, a Sunday through Saturday schedule Sunday Monday Tuesday Wednesday Thursday Friday Saturday and the first week of January is only Wednesday through Saturday so this weekend is only one day I have a box for next week a box for notes my line a day my water tracker my prayer log my word of the day which includes the slang word of the day, which I found to be really fun. Um, it's quite hilarious what the words are supposed to mean when they mean something totally different in real life. <laughs> um, but I did want to send a shout out to Boho Berry. She is the whole reason why I'm doing this Dutch door layout. I'm really, really excited about this. Um, I'm totally scared to death to cut it into my 
journal, but I figure it, I watched her do it like four or five times and as scared as she was and she did it anyway and it turned out super, I know I can do this. So the first thing I'm going to do is actually make the cut. Um, because if I don't do it now, I probably won't do it at all. So I have to do it while I have the guts to do it. So here's my X-Acto knife. It's super sharp. I've used it like twice on wrapping paper. <laughs> and I have a piece of cardboard in here so I don't cut beyond the pages that I want to. Hopefully. I'm going to turn this this way so I can just cut a straight line toward me. Okay, you guys, say a little prayer. Here we go. Oh, I can do this. And I have no idea how many pages I'm cutting through right now, which is also very scary. But seriously, if I don't do this right now, I'm not going to do it at all. Ooh, I got them. I cut through them all. Oh, that scared me. Okay. Whew. Adrenaline rush. My face feels really hot and red right now. Okay, so the next step is to remove the inner pages because this is the one we're gluing to. So this is to remove um, the next step to remove these. I'm just going to remove them at the first row of dots um, because I don't want the binding to come undone. Oh, where did I leave my glue runner? Okay. There we go. Now I have scrap pieces for when I make mistakes. All right, hold on. So let's put the lid back on here. Okay. So what I'm gonna do is glue the first page, uh, Habit Tracker right here to the last page for the month. So let me, I'm using a Tomo Mono, let's see. It's my Tombow adhesive. Oh my gosh, I did it. <gasps> I cut my journal. Okay, you guys. I made Dutch doors. Oh, <sighs> okay. So I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten modules for each week. <laughs> oh, my throat is really dry. That is something crazy. Um, and I did set them up a little bit differently. Each one is just arranged a little bit differently, but everything is still the same um, from week to week. And then next we have February. So let me stick my cardboard back in here so I don't lose it. I did cut through it. That knife is sharp. Okay. Thank you for sticking with me. <laughs> this is so, this that was really scary for me. I don't know if you've ever done that before. But wow, that was scary. Okay. So let's go ahead and do the top part. Let's 
going to get a little wonky here for a second. I apologize. January of 2020 starts on a Wednesday. Monday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, and Saturday. Cartoon Day. Who was an 80s kid that remembers Cartoon Day on Saturdays? Apologize for that.